Hello, I'm Jay Nickel from Nickel Investigations, and I'm here to tell you about some of the upcoming episodes of Ontario Cold Cases, a podcast. At 1 p.m. on Wednesday, May 14th, 1975, a teenage boy walking through Marie Curtis Park in the west end of Toronto found the body of five-year-old Tracy Ann Bruni in 18 inches of water near a bridge in Etobicoke Creek, 15 kilometers from the youngster's home. She had died of drowning, but there were cuts and bruises all over her head and neck from a beating administered by her killer. An autopsy showed she had not been sexually assaulted. She was last seen alive by her mother at 9 a.m. when she was dropped off at St. Clair Catholic School on North Cliff Boulevard. On the weekend, Tracy's purse was found in a yard on North Cliff Boulevard, suggesting someone forcefully pulled her into a car near the school. So please consider subscribing to Ontario Cold Cases, a podcast on Patreon, Spotify, YouTube, or Apple Podcasts.